We are middle Georgia proud. It is the moment of a lifetime. That's what one Warner Robins police officer says after being selected to carry the torch for the opening ceremony of the Special Olympics Winter Games. Carlos Stevens joins us live and he spoke with Officer Greg Martin about his experience. Carlos, good evening to you. Greg, good evening to you. Officer Martin tells me being selected to give hope to over 900 athletes is something that truly warms his heart. Special Olympics Georgia is the first and only nonprofit organization that offers training and competition to people with intellectual disabilities. More than 17,000 athletes participate in 27 different sports. Warner Robins police officer Greg Martin was selected to escort the flame of hope at the state winter games. It's an experience he doesn't take for granted. Every time that I've been chosen to carry the torch, it's, it's been a, an honor. The officer torch run for the Special Olympics was started in the 80s. At first, it included just a few officers, but Martin says the goal for the founders was to make the event special, just like the Olympics. Martin says the event is now international and has grown to be the largest in the world. Law enforcement torch run is the Special Olympics what the fire department is the MDA. Warner Robins Police Department raised more than $18,000 for Special Olympics Georgia, hosting events like Polar Plunge, Hops on Donut Shops, and hosting the Law Enforcement Torch Run Base Tournament. Martin says these athletes deserve the same opportunity as anyone else. Everybody that's involved just wants to give them that experience of being able to compete um, you know, in, in the Olympics. Martin says he's no stranger to Special Olympics. He's been involved since high school, an interest that he wanted to take with him in his career. And when I found out it was you know, to benefit Special Olympics, I was all on it. And now Martin says the reward is breathtaking. And a lot of officers that have gotten involved started out just attending games and handing out medals. And the first time that they put a medal around an athlete's neck and they get that smile and that hug, man, it seals the deal. You just, there's no greater feeling in the world. Now, Officer Martin went on to tell me that he's hoping to get more agencies involved. We're live here in Houston County. I'm Carlos Stevens, WGXA News. Greg, truly something to be proud of. It certainly is, Carlos. Well